<laughs> Y'all hear that? Oh my gosh. Y'all hear that? This is Just a Touch of J from the Just a Touch of J podcast show, baby. And you are listening to Beat Break Radio. 87 FM and Reach One Network. <laughs> Y'all know it's everything podcast, it's right? Catch me your weekdays. 12-ish, 12.30-ish p.m. to 1 p.m. on BeatBreakRadioFM.com and ReachOneNetwork.com. This is just a touch of your baby. Y'all know I put it out there in pieces for you. Listen to the Just a Touch of J podcast show. It's up next. <laughs> I just had to drop a bomb on him like flex. And don't forget to download the Just a Touch of J app. Y'all hear that? All right. And go over to My Name is R O N I 76 on Instagram, baby. This is just a touch check out making love and bees. Y'all know I put it all out there in pieces for you, baby. Hey y'all, this is Just a Touch of J, and I'm coming at you, getting ready to put it all out there in pieces, baby. What's cracking with my babies, huh? What y'all out there doing? <laughs> what my babies out there doing, huh? What y'all out there doing on today? Y'all out there shining on them, hmm? Cause they hate it, baby. Living your best life. Doing what it is that you do, that you do, that you do. Woo! Are y'all out there doing it? I know y'all there. I know you are. I know that you are out there being so thin and so wise, baby. You know why I know this? First of all, y'all already know how it goes because God made you that way. Shout out to you, God, for making us all thin and wise. Man, listen. He is rewarded to those who diligently seek him. Okay, God is so good. Oh my gosh, I love God. I love God. Now listen, moving along, what is the second reason why I know that y'all are out there being so thrilled and so wise, baby? What is the second reason? Because y'all are out here listening to me. Okay, and you know that you got to be thorough and you got to be wise if you are out here listening to me, baby, because this is just a touch of J. Y'all know I'm thorough and I'm wise, and you know I put it out there in pieces for you. So look, Baba gotta drop a dime on you, yes. Mama about to drop a dime on you, yes. But before I drop a dime on you, y'all already know what I gotta say to y'all. I gotta give a shout to my haters. And what do I say to these haters, y'all? Come on, say it with me. (laughs) <laughs> on three, all right, you ready? One, two, three. Hi, haters, cause y'all need this work too. Yes, y'all need this work too. So, if you are just coming over to the Just Touch J experience, you're like, wait a minute, hold on, what's going on? Why is this woman giving a shout out to her haters, okay? Let me break it down to you, all right? When you are shining bright like a diamond, yes, woo! Shining bright like a diamond, you know, like Rihanna. Shout out to you, Rihanna, if you listening, because you never know who listen to y'all, okay? And shout out to you, Black China, and everybody been in my stories, too. This is just such a J. Y'all are so thorough and wise. Oh, my gosh, yes. Y'all are doing you all look. Let me go ahead and start talking about these haters. Let me get back to these haters. I ain't going to go there yet. So anyway, what happens is that when you shine bright like a diamond, like Rihanna, sometimes, you know, haters come up. And they're like, wait a minute, hold on. He over there shining on him. She over there shining on him too. What's going on? What's cracking over there? So what happens is they start peeking on over, you know, to the left, to the left, to the left, trying to check out to see what you're doing, you know, that it is that you do, that you do, that you do. And, um, you know, they wind up basically getting blessed by the message, okay? Because God prepares a table for you in the presence of your enemies because he got to put it out there in pieces for them so they can watch you eat, so they can know who he is, okay? That's it. And sometimes, you know, that light, it just, like, blinds them. So they don't know what's happening. They get all, you know, disturbed and they got to see what's going on. So you got to tell your haters. Never hate on them, okay? They're a ladder to the next level. You don't hate on them. You just say, hi, haters. 
Cause y'all need this work too. Yes, y'all need this work too. So look, if y'all been going over to my name is O and I seven six on Instagram, baby. Oh my gosh, mama been putting it out there in pieces for you. Yes, dropping a dime on you. I got Jay's fit. Get ready to come out. Now look. I ain't tell y'all those days nothing like that, but Jay's fit. It's, you know, fitness stuff. You know, I've been telling y'all this for a minute now. You know, it's finally arrived. And mama is just so excited. And also, you know, I've been putting it out there in peace for y'all behind some of that little music I've been dropping. You know, with little Chris Brown remakes and stuff like that. You know, just putting myself out there in pieces, baby. You know, doing it the best way that I know how to do it. Now, let me talk to you about something else. The Just a Touch of J cannabis line. Okay, for all of my herbs, my herb lovers out there, you know that's doing what it is that you do that you do, okay? Mama's working on some stuff. I've been working on for the last four years, but I got these papers coming out, y'all. French European. Oh my gosh, baby, the finest, finest French European papers, okay? Y'all got to check that out. All right. Y'all got to check that out. Yes. Guess what it's called? I told y'all this before. All you need is just a touch of the J. Yeah. So make sure y'all go ahead and get done when I drop a dime on you. Okay. And this is just a touch of J.com. All right. Make sure y'all check that out. I'm putting it out there on, you know, on social media. Facebook. Y'all already got it. Y'all get it first. My private Facebook page. But I'll be dropping a dime on y'all here and there so y'all can know what's going on. All right. So look for them. One, one, fourth, you know, King. Maxi pack, oh my gosh, magnetic booklet. <sighs> Dang, sexy, sexy baby. Yeah, this is just a touch of there, baby. I'm definitely dropping a dime on you with them, okay? Now, look, skating on over to making love in these kitchen. Mom ain't been giving you too much over there, okay? That's my cooking stuff for y'all who just coming over to the whole Just a Touch of J experience. You know, I go ahead and I do the chef thing and I put some stuff out there for y'all, but I did on my name is R O N I76. Just drop a dime on you. Okay. Or just some dehydrated apples and things that I've been doing for the week. So, you know, you can check that out if you want to. You know, I'll be on Make a Love Beats Kitchen too. I don't know. You know, just do what it is that you do. Twitter, Tumblr, Facebook. I'm everywhere. Just Google Just a Touch of J, baby. Now, let me drop a dime on you. Mama got some pieces. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Yeah, check out the Just a Touch of J app too. Okay. Download that. You don't got it. You get all exclusiveness, things that I got going on, you know. Shout out to you, baby. <laughs> the love of my life. I got to give a shout out to you. And um, that's it. Now, listen, before I get there, you might be like, damn, Jay kind of sound like she out of breath. Her voice is a little jacked up. Let me tell you what's going on. And this is how I got this, you know, thing right here. I'm about to drop a dime on you about. So, you know, every morning I get up at like five. Y'all know I get up and do what it is that I do. So I shower, you know, do all that, and I'm out running. And I got horrible allergies. But, you know, I do my little four miles, you know, in the morning and the evening, you know. I got to do something with this COVID stuff that's going on. I'm working on this body, okay? So I'm out there and I'm doing that, but my allergies just been jacked up. So my voice comes and goes, all right? And sometimes I can't even record the podcast for y'all because I'll be so jacked up. You ain't going to be able to hear me. So I'm here now, and I got to drop a dime on y'all. So just be patient with me as I put this out there in pieces for you, all right? So I'm out there doing what it is that I do, and I get this, like, boom, just dropped in my spirit. And I start to thinking. And y'all know what happens when I start thinking. I said, oh, my God, somebody need this work. I know somebody need this work. I needed to work at one time, too. So this is what I'm about to talk to y'all about. <sighs> Relationships. Oh, my God. Yes, this is part of the Love Doctor series. Like, I put this in the Love Doctor series. I always do the Love Doctor series. For those of y'all who don't know what it is, I do it, like, certain parts of the year. But this year, I've just been doing it all year. Like, whenever, you know, I get something, you know, I get inspired and something coming to me, I just talk about the Love Doctor series. So, we are talking about the Love Doctor series. This is the series where I come to y'all and I school y'all on love. Listen, I didn't have my share, okay? So, I know a little something about it now. So, we getting ready to talk about 
being in relationships and acting fake. Yes, when you can't be yourself in a relationship. And ain't y'all out there going through that? Huh? Are you out there like literally in a relationship that you got to be fake in? Oh my gosh, this is just a touch of J, baby. I got to drop a dime on you. Y'all out there doing that? Like, help me out, Lord. Because <laughs> I, I, I don't, I don't want to put, you know, nobody business out there nothing like that. But I, I know some people, you know, I myself, I used to be in some relationships where I couldn't be myself. You know, you get in these relationships and you just like, you know, I like them, you know, but you don't want to tell them too much. You don't want to do this. But you, but what it is, though, deep down on the inside is you're not being yourself. And here y'all out there going through that. I know you are. Y'all out there being fake and phony in these relationships. So I know somebody, right? And I did a podcast on this before, but I remember him just saying certain things about how, you know, um, he just couldn't do this and he couldn't do that. And, you know, he couldn't let her know he had certain female friends and, you know, he couldn't um, behave this way. And then I had another girlfriend. She's like, no, I I can't do that with him. And I'm saying to myself, well, why are you in the relationship then? I mean, ain't you supposed to be in a relationship with somebody you can be yourself with? I mean, look, this just a touch of that, baby. I'm just, I'm asking y'all a question. Don't you want to be in a relationship with somebody that you could just let your guard down with? Girl, like, take your hair off. If you got on a fake wig or whatever, let him see your hair. Like, that type of thing. Like, don't have to wear makeup. Can just sit, you know, y'all in the bed, laugh, talk. You know, don't got to be ashamed of your past, yourself. Just putting it out there in pieces, both of y'all. Y'all just okay. Or are you in a relationship where you just like, you can't even talk? Mm. You got this fake person on like, yeah, <laughs> yeah, you know, yeah. But really, you just like, I can't stand this mother. Okay, now. Especially in this COVID stuff. Thank you, God. Got to drop something on me. Y'all out here, this COVID stuff got y'all home now. Mm. Or like, because you know you could catch COVID through sex. So now you only mess with one person or whatever because you ain't trying to put it out there. Peace for everybody. So you like trying to commit now, you know, because the whole COVID thing. Okay, you like, I got to be with one person because I don't know what's going on out here. So you trying to do what it is that you do and you know you really can't stand them or you just realize that you can't stand them, but you don't know how to get out of it because you don't know how to put them pieces out there for them. You just being fake. Why are y'all doing that? Hold on one second. I gotta eat me a uh I gotta eat me an olive because I just mm, mm. y'all gotta try these olives from Trader Joe's the calamari olives mm, with the brine and extra virgin olive oil with the black top. Mm, this is just a touch of that baby. Listen, they go real, real good with just the finest piece of cheese. <laughs> Oh my God. Okay, look. Let me get back. So, look, y'all out there doing that? Why? You want me to tell you why? Wait, before I tell you why. Like, let's let's go through some stuff. Like, I need you to ask yourself why you are even doing it. Like, I do. Like, this is what this podcast is about. Because why would you even deal with something like that? Is it because you like being fake and phony? Mm. Some of y'all like being fake and phony. Not all y'all. But some of y'all so fake and so phony that you don't even know the difference between real and fake. You out here being so fake that you with somebody fake. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. How can you be with somebody fake that you can't stand? If you ain't fake yourself. Because real recognize real, baby. Okay? Real recognize real. You ain't messing with nobody if you real. That's fake. You like this nigga fake. She fake. You can't do it. So you got to ask yourself a question. Because it's all about you. What is it that you believe about yourself that has you in this relationship that you being faking? This is just a touch of J, baby. I am trying to put it out to your pieces for you. I swear I am. I need y'all to get this. Y'all out here messed up trying to figure out what he doing all up in his phone 
or you the guy trying to manipulate the girl, manipulating her, you know, doing this and doing that to see what she does. Oh my gosh. Or you the girl or the woman or whatever you want to call yourself out here trying to go ahead and do what it is that you do. Just being fake. Why? What is the purpose of it? Ain't you supposed to love the one that you with and be, just love them? Check out their podcast. Love the one you with. Right? Just such a day. Like I said, baby, I'll be putting it out there. Peace for y'all. Check it out. You are supposed to be happy, not sad. You're supposed to be able to communicate, talk, laugh, have a good time. Y'all out here not communicating from one person to the next, but then trying to figure out why it don't never work. Oh, my God. Just just touch it, baby. I need y'all to get this together. It has to have something to do with you. It's a time when you got to check yourself because you out here wrecking yourself. I already know this is going to turn into a whole series. Y'all going to call me up. Y'all going to be like, you got to keep talking about that. I already know it. Because you out here in these fake behind relationships. Tell me why. Call in. I need you to call in. And tell me why. The number's on the Just a Touch of J app. It's the 856 number. All right. Begins with 336. Check it out. Go ahead and do it. It's on all my other stuff too. All the podcast stuff. Look in the descriptions. You can call in. Leave me a message. Let me know. We will get back in contact with you because it's thousands in case. Y'all, listen, it's like a, a hundred something thousand. Y'all, y'all out here really listening to me. Shout out to y'all out there in Zimbabwe. Yes. <laughs> in Germany, everywhere. This is Just a Touch of J. Love you know y'all put out here piece of twin but seriously why are you out here in these relationships where you can't be yourself what is wrong with you why are you giving it the time of day you know they ain't no good now listen i know you might say well jay you know every relationship ain't perfect no relationship is perfect. You got ups and downs. One minute you like another person, next minute you don't. You know, it's a lot going on. It's what it is. It's a relationship, right? Because you have to relate with each other. So if you can't relate and you being fake, I need you to ask yourself why. And I need you to understand that if you are out here being fake with a fake relationship that you can't be yourself in, baby, that says a lot about you. Mm. This is just a touch of J. It says a lot about you when you got to put on a representative or become what it is that they want you to become or what you think that they need. You out here doing all this extra stuff because you can't be you. Why are you entertaining it? Mm. Y'all got to check yourself for y'all wreck yourself. I did a podcast on that too. Oh my gosh. Look, y'all, just go back and just check them out, okay? But this is going to keep on going. I love this. I love this. Call in. Let me know why y'all out here faking. Why are you out here faking? And these, I mean, even faking sex. Some of y'all are out here. I got to do a whole topic on fake sex. Y'all out here faking sex. Why? Acting like it's good when it's not. For what? For what? You know you can't stand having sex with her. But you still having sex with her. You know. You know he ain't rocking your world, girl. You know he ain't putting it out there in pieces for you. But you still dealing with it. Why? Tell him. Tell him right now. It's horrible. I can't deal with it. I need you to spice it up. Work on it. Something. But don't be fake. Don't be fake because it says a lot about you. It says a lot about you. Real recognize real, baby. Real don't deal with fake. Real don't deal with foolishness. Real don't deal with it. But when you fake, you can't deal with real neither. So maybe that's why you out here putting it in pieces for the fake ones. Because when you don't got yourself together, you can't deal with nobody that's thorough. You can't. Because you're going to be all over the place. You're going to be like, damn, this is too hard for me. Because you're used to dealing with that unnecessary stuff. But it has to be, you know, a problem with you. You got, you got to check yourself. All right, so look. I just want to drop a dime on y'all with that. There's a lot of y'all out there. A lot of y'all out there. Y'all listen to me. Some of y'all, you know, in just blissful, beautiful relationships, you don't have no issues at all. You know, you could be yourself. You're happy. You know, you do what it is that you do, that you do. Shout it bright like a diamond. Yes, you're doing all that. You know, you don't have no problems. You have your little stuff, you know, you got going on. You talk about it. You move on. You don't let things carry on. You don't, you don't do all that type of stuff. You're an adult. You know how to handle stuff. But some people, hmm, 
Y'all out here doing that unnecessary stuff. Every year, still doing the same thing, still don't got together. Ask yourself why. I need you to check yourself. You have to change. I can't have my babies out here lost. There's too many of y'all. I tell you all the time. I can't. I'm obligated. God put me out here to put out there in pieces for y'all. Y'all have to stop. Stop being in these relationships, these fake relationships, having sex with people just because. You know, it ain't good, it's good. You just out here, just out here in the wilderness, just doing whatever. You know, losing it, don't got it together, don't know why it's working out. And I really think that the deciding factor has a lot to do with you. I mean, seriously, shout out to you, Kia Henderson. <laughs> I love Kia, Kia, Kia be dropping diamonds on. But you know what Kia says? That's my pastor, y'all. Yeah, on Texas. This is what Kia said. Keon says you have to evaluate your decision-making process. You will look overlook scrutiny just to satisfy a need. Okay? A need. You might need sex, so you know, this, I got to be fake so I can get that. Mm. Just touch that, baby. You might need a little love. I need love. Boo-doo. Check that one out too. I did a podcast on that. When you need love, it got LL on the outside. You know, a picture of him with his hat with a girl. Check that out too, man. Because some of y'all need love. Y'all out here being fake trying to get... But you out here being fake and you get fake love from somebody that's fake because you fake. Because you can't get no real love from nobody that's real because you being fake. Oh my God, this is just a touch that baby. I just need y'all to check yourself. Okay, so look. That's the end of that. I ain't even going to keep on going on and going on and going on. You know you out here being fake if you being fake. You being fake in a relationship that you don't really want to be in, but you in, or you doing a whole bunch of trickery, tricks of the trade. You know, when you don't have to do that, all you got to do is love the one you with. And if that ain't the one you supposed to be with, go find the one that you love and be with that one and make it work. And just, it's it's, it's better because it's love. Maybe some of y'all just don't want no love. I don't know what you out here doing, but this just touch that baby. Call in, let me know. I just had to drop a dime on y'all and put that out there in pieces for you, okay? Make sure y'all make sure y'all stay tuned for my cannabis lovers. I'm telling y'all, y'all gonna love these papers and these things I got covered in y'all. Oh my gosh! So look, how do you want me to end this? Huh? Y'all want me to say it like this? This is just a touch of J, baby. Y'all know I put it out there in pieces for you. <laughs> Wait, hold on. I forgot. Wait. Who is this? That's how I got said. That's how I got said. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Who is this? Come on, y'all. What is this? What is this? What is this? This is just a touch of J, baby. Yes. Y'all know I put it out there in pieces for you. <laughs> yes, baby, I do. So, look, how do I end this? Y'all know how I end this, okay? This is how I end this. Don't let nobody make you feel like you ain't thrilled and wise. No. Please don't. And if you out there in a fake relationship, that means you ain't being thrilled and wise. Or you might have somebody to make you feel like you ain't good. That's why you in it. I don't know what you got going on. But please don't. Shine on them. Okay? That's the second thing. Because they hate it, baby. Yes, shine on them. Live your life, your best life. And don't care about somebody who don't like it. Because that's what I'm doing. I'm shining on them. You know, we all go through stuff. I go through stuff. But you got to get yourself together, put them pieces back in order, and shine on them, baby. Let them hate it and keep it moving. And the last thing that I tell y'all is spread love. You know why? Because it's the Brooklyn way. And if you was loving yourself, you won't be out here in these fake relationships, fake ass relationships. I got to say it like that. I don't know I'm a Christian or anything, but ass is in the Bible. Okay, look, <laughs> this is just such a jack. All right, y'all out here doing it. Y'all out here, like, I need you to grow up. I need you to grow up. I need you to act your age. I need you to, you know, because some of y'all young out here, y'all listen to me too. But I need, I need you to really think about this. 
Okay, quick recap. You got to think about this. Why would you be with somebody that you can't be yourself with? Why would you be fake in a relationship? Because that's what you being if you can't be yourself. Hmm? Why would you have sex with somebody and you know it's not good and you faking it? Hmm? Why do you keep going from partner to partner? You got to be careful out here because you don't know y'all catch that COVID through sex. But why are you doing that? Like, why are you breaking hearts and going from this to the next and letting you? You just don't have yourself together. That's why you got to check yourself. Oh, my gosh. You got to check yourself. You might be wrecking yourself out here in these fake-ass relationships. <laughs> okay, look. This is just such a day, baby. Just try to put it out there in pieces for y'all. So, look, I'm up out of here. I got stuff I need to do. I'm going to go ahead and eat some more of these olives. Got to work on the Just a Touch of J cannabis line for y'all. You know, and I'm going to chill. Okay, I'm going to chill today. And I need y'all to chill. I need y'all to think about this. Please call in. Let me know. Give me some feedback. Why are people out here in these relationships like this? I think, seriously, it's because they just don't love themselves. They don't know what love is. Because when you know what love is, baby, you don't settle for nothing less. You don't. You're like, uh-uh, that one right there, I know that one love me. I got to be with that one. We just got to figure this out. Because you don't have time for the fakeness of something that's less than that. Like, if you got love, I got love on my mind. You know, you that type of love? Please don't give me the signal, y'all, because y'all know I'm putting out there pieces for y'all. I would drop a dime on you with that Luther. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Let me go ahead and get on up out of here, y'all. I love y'all. Okay, and I'll be back when I got something else to say. Hey, (laughs) y'all. This is just a touch of J, baby. What y'all out there doing? Y'all out there shining on them because they hate it, baby, living your best life. Huh? Doing what it is that you do. Well, listen, mama got to drop a dime on y'all, but I want y'all to listen to the song of the week, right? Yeah, it's a remake, you know, with just a touch of J2. All right, let me know what y'all think. Call in, all right? Yeah, full songs are going to be coming up soon, and make sure y'all go over to uh, Making Love and V's Kitchen, baby. And check out the Just a Touch of J app, too. Mm-hmm. Mama just dropped the uh, sweet potato brownie recipe for y'all on the Just a Touch of J app. Y'all, y'all want that. Trust me. I know you do. All right? Listen to the songs. They up next. Y'all hear that? Did y'all like that? <laughs> yeah, man. I just want to talk to y'all for a little bit. Mm-hmm. Y'all gonna make sure y'all go over there. Make a loving beast kitchen, baby. Mm-hmm. I'm definitely putting it out there in pieces for you. Oh, 
hard, baby. Mm. Y'all hear that? <laughs> it's called the uh, the box. <laughs> what do y'all know about the box? Get to make sure that y'all go over to make a love in this kitchen, baby. Mm-hmm. <laughs> make sure y'all scroll around and uh, grab a taste. Let me touch you. Stop putting out the pieces. Let me touch you, squeeze and roll. 
And then mama put it out these pieces for you. He can love me, I don't trust you. Know that he's no freaking hunting. I just wanna talk to y'all for a little bit. Gosh, you love in the restroom. Say she my man, no doubt. Let me girl know I wanna sex you. I don't like talking, I'ma text you. Making this move be your best move. Going straight to voicemail, can't get through. Baby girl, come let me dress you. Y'all know this is just a picture, Jay. Come on, man. I'm acting like I'm not going to play that game. Let's do this. You don't want to play games with me. I'm definitely throwing the wild ass. In the restroom, making love. She give it up. Y'all better make sure y'all pay attention to me. You better make sure you pay attention to me. Oh my gosh, this is just a touch and take. Tell me what I'm doing, baby. Put that out here, peace out. Cause this is just a touch and take. What did I just say? I don't know what I've been doing, guys. I don't know what I've been doing. This is just a touch and take. Gotta call the way you worry about me. Alright, y'all. I think y'all get it. This is just a touch and take. And he's just trying to put it out. My name is R O N I seven six on Instagram, baby. Download the Just a Touch of J app. Google me. I'm in 150 countries now, baby. Cause this is Just a Touch of J. Y'all hear that? <laughs> this is Just a Touch of J, baby. Coming at you, putting it all out there in peace. I just had to drop a bomb on my flesh. <laughs> oh my gosh, just that work, baby. And baby, you know you fine, right? You're fine. <laughs> hey y'all, this is Just a Touch of J and I'm coming at you Making love in these kitchen, y'all hear that? Oh my gosh, <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> You better download that Just a Touch of J app <laughs> J, J, J My name is R O N I 76 on Instagram, baby. Oh my gosh, check out Making Love in V's Kitchen. Uh, Y'all know I put it out there in peace. I almost forgot. Oh my gosh, this is a song of the week. <laughs> I'm off a tab with a synthetic sundown, 45 minutes to set it. Woo! Check it for the kid, I had to oh, chin check man. a big move And we teaching big Y'all lessons here. over here Two folk coming heavy like we bench pressing And I'm gonna Y'all deliver every just time just like a chip message In the south, then I'm feeling like a pimp You a simp, I don't feel bad for you, I ain't sympathetic <laughs> I just hit the pig, <laughs> the way the I just be laughing on here Oh my to tell gosh, y'all know I'm still the wild I'm a skin tech <laughs> boy to the death Go and get it through your head until it's mother embedded <laughs> She said that I'm full of myself, go ahead and bust it open, I'ma show you where the big head is Half of us ain't even got a whip, then we try and grip grain, first step is going and get ready uh, Hit you with the words of wisdom, Oof. new balance on me while I'm searching for some Try and touch me out in public cause they hurt I'm the one I peel off like my skin when it get burnt in the sun Self-conscious face blush with ease, Levi's put a taper on my tongue grease But I'm still on the block when it's 103 and humid in the city but I'm sitting comfortably yeah. 
I'm off a tab with that synthetic sundown 45 minutes till the set it Check it for the kid, I had a chin check him big move And we teach him big lessons over here Two folk coming heavy like we bench pressing And I'm gonna deliver every time just like a sent message In the south then I'm feeling like a pimp You a simp, I don't feel bad for you, I ain't sympathetic And when they ask me how I made it <laughs> Oh my gosh, you know what I'ma say I just be doing whatever God tell me to do